Hey, you cool cats and kittens. <laughs> Come to my table. <laughs> tasty cocktails to go with the new show they put out every week. We might be able to uh, share in a bevy or two together. So today we are going to do our version of a bathtub gin fizz with exactly what we have in our liquor cabinet right now. So we know we're all limited on supplies since it's like quarantine time. So we're going to be using bottled lemon and lime juice. So we'll go ahead and show you what we're going to be putting together. So here's what you'll need. We've got our local gin. This is made in Loveland, Colorado. And a little bit of lemon juice. Half ounce of lime juice. Half ounce of Chambord, which is a raspberry liqueur. Some homemade simple syrup. Here we've used one part local honey and one part boiling water and waited till it's cooled down. And egg white. So we're gonna start with an empty shaker. Add your Chambord. Half ounce of lime juice. Lemon juice goes in. Then a half ounce of your homemade simple syrup. Here are a few brands that are creating non-alcoholic options for mixers. So you can still partake in creating fun cocktails like this one. Ounce and a half of gin. And we'll put a little bit extra in for good measure. And go ahead and add a little bit of ice to your shaker. And then we're gonna separate the egg white from the yolk here. Alternative here is to use heavy cream. If you're looking for a vegan or vegetarian option here, you can use what's known as aquafaba. It's the leftover liquid from a can of chickpeas. So if you put a little bit in here and shake it up, it'll give you pretty much the same consistency. All right, so in goes the egg white. And then you shake. <laughs> Small glass, because if it's too big, then you'll drink as much as the glass. <laughs> 